this is Light Dark Blade 93 and welcome to the another 2016 update video. With my friend Dizzy Pertani Knight. As for always. Yes. I'm slightly dying in the background, don't mind me. <clears throat> well, anyways, on my Shadow Deflate channel, you would notice my uh you will see a new video that I uploaded, and it's a little different than <coughs> my from my Let's Plays that I do normally, but this is really special, because now I got a new controller today. Yeah. And it's blue! Yes, it's a blue it's afterglow blue. controller. I love blue. Now I can take this out for a moment. Um... Like the best thing since sliced bread. Oh yes, yes. I tested my uh, my new gamepad controller on uh, yeah. Dead or Alive Five last round. How did it work for you? Pretty good. That's good. That's At good. least the button, the right trigger doesn't stick. Jesus Christ! I hate when buttons stick on controllers. Yes. Since my red one is so old, it sticks more and more than usual. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. That's the thing with old controllers. They start doing weird crap. Yeah. With my PS2, it's a lot older than anything else I have. Yeah, I've gone through so many GameCube controllers just because I played the GameCube so much. Yeah. That's the same thing with like my uh, my 360. I have I have like three controllers. One that came on the console. The control stick is a bit sticky and. Uh, eh, sticky. I know the, uh, my my <laughs> my most recent one, which is a platinum controller, is kind of getting a sticky thing. Otherwise, it works fine. Yeah. You know, I wish there was a shop or something that can actually help uh, by cleaning your controllers. Yeah, it's kind of actually annoying to clean controllers, especially when you have to take the uh, friggin' case off and actually kind of do that, yeah. Yeah. But, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do, I suppose. Yes. Now, pretty much one of the most oldest of the oldest systems I have is pretty much, take a guess, everyone. Um. I have a regular PlayStation, a PlayStation 2, and my DSi, and my computer. Say, <laughs> Dissy, try to take a guess which one is my oldest game console. I'm assuming it's the original PlayStation. Nope. <laughs> that is not my oldest no. system that I have. Even though I bought that when I was 15 system? from Amazon. Uh, I bought that system? brand new. Back in 2010. 2010, that was like forever ago. Yeah. And it, I haven't been playing it for a while, so. That makes me think. I think I came on Steam in 2010. Yes, you did. Yeah. Yeah. February 16th. But I got, I do believe I, if I got my, P, my PlayStation in 2011, I think, because I was... Still, in, still a sophomore when I got it. <clears throat> yeah. When I mean I'm, I was a sophomore, I, it means I was back in high school. Yeah, I know, because I'm currently. Yep. <clears throat> I was gonna say, um, I the oldest console I used to have, but it it broke was the Super Nintendo. Ah, yeah. The no. The current one that's like the oldest and like when it came out that I still have is the N sixty four. I love N sixty four. The that that console is what I loved because I played oh, yeah. it at a we friend's have, house. Uh, yeah, we still have Super Mario sixty four and the uh, the little uh, cart cart holder. 
Nice. Uh, yeah. I think, yeah, I don't know. When I started playing uh, on the N64, uh, I played a Pokemon game on the N64, and it was Pokemon Stadium. Oh, yeah, that game. Yeah, that's I'm when I started that playing Pokemon games. Uh, I've never played a Pokemon game, but I don't think I could really get into it. It's not my style of game, personally. Yeah, only if it's like battle sequence for you. No, I mean, like, just like, I don't know. Something about, I, it's something, this, I, it doesn't hook me. I don't find it that interesting. Yeah. But Pokemon uh, uh, is pretty me. old, but which one's more older? It's either Digimon or Pokemon, but they've been around for a long time. Yeah. They made Pokemon. Digimon, um, Duel Masters, Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, yeah. Um, <laughs> I'm trying to think of whatever, uh, what else. Yeah. Uh, what other anime they started, uh, making or shows that did, like, cards and all that. Um. For some reason, my game is really loud. Holy shit. <laughs> better oh yeah oh, and I, yeah if my commentary sucks i'm playing leopard too sorry yeah and also uh they made bakugan yeah yeah, yeah bakugan. i uh i think i used to like bakugan but that was a long time ago yeah i didn't even understand uh the story of bakugan bow brawlers at first until i, I read the I, wikipedia I, I, I think I watched, like, a couple episodes of that anime. It was an anime, too, wasn't it? Yes. Yeah, I think I watched a couple episodes of that because I mostly, like, bought the toys and that sort of stuff. In fact, I still have that in my room, that uh, board. Yeah? I have a couple different boards. I have a smaller one and, like, a large one. I have a DS game of Bakugan. <laughs> I actually didn't know that they made games of Bakugan. Yeah. On a certain website that me and George played on, uh, he had a Colossus. Really? Darak. Colossus. Grab and puke. <laughs> Grab and puke? <laughs> Grab and puke? <laughs> to the person who made Left for Speed, this is a special shout out to you. Left for Speed. Oh, dear God. I haven't watched that animation in a long, long time. But I enjoyed Left for Speed 2, because it's a parody of Left 4 Dead 2. And it's hella funny. It's like, I don't know. Unrelated, like, this is really unrelated, but before I got on this, I was watching Markiplier do challenges. Oh, God. That's why you find those videos funny. Yes. Especially... Freaking the, he uh, did the waxing challenge. challenge. The one that made me the laugh the most. Dude, he did the waxing challenge. Oh, God. Really, did he? Yeah. And it I can tell like, you this. The two ones that made me... What? I can tell you this. It was entertaining, and it was making me cringe. I think the one that made me laugh the most, besides the whisper challenges, was the, the photo booth ice, ice, uh, ice bath. Oh, God. That had me laughing because I know how cold that kind of crap is because I've taken ice baths before. They're uh, interesting, at that least. You know, pretty soon, everyone, I will do Let's Plays on my phone. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he, Zach, discovered a feature where he can record his uh, record gameplay on his phone of what he's playing. Yeah, so I can pretty much record Plague Inc. on my phone, so I can yeah. do recordings of that. Yeah, he told me he told me that like a couple of weeks ago, actually. Yes. And I also told my friend uh, Colton as well. 
Since then, everyone, me and Ray have been friends since 2010. Oh, yeah. Same year on Siemens when I met this dingleberry you're listening to. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. And that's be That's even be That's also in the same year I got Earthbound Dark Snipe onto Steam as well. I.E. George. Yep. So, if you guys also want more recordings, like uh, us playing Black Mesa and all that, oh my god. <laughs> Uh, uh, yeah, speaking of that, that was uploaded a little while ago, I saw that. Yeah. Those videos were recorded during the 11th of this month of February. And tomorrow yep. is Valentine's Day! I'm glad I'm not going to be on during Valentine's Day, if you don't tell you that much. Yeah. I got crap to do tomorrow. Yeah. I might be on if I'm not, if it's like, uh, when I'm done with my whole shopping target adventure, I might be on. It just depends on how late it is. Oh, yeah. Uh. <laughs> uh. So yeah. You got him. So, if you guys saw my, uh, video that I uploaded on my Shadow Play channel, yeah. My controller is awesome. It's it is blue. pretty cool. I like the glow, the blue glow. And it's hella bright, if you haven't noticed. <laughs> I know, I do, I know. You can ask Ray, he had a, he, he has a afterglow controller, do you? Yeah, I used to have one before. It was a, I used to have one for the GameCube, but that was years ago. Yeah. But I, I can tell you this. Blue color. Shout out to the to the people that makes the Afterglow controllers. So that's a shout out to you guys, and yeah, I really enjoy your controllers. They're pretty awesome. Yeah, most third party controllers, you know, can barely last a while, but sometimes you can get some good brand. Yes. It just kind of really depends. Yes. I, that didn't really make any sense what they just said, so take that with a grain of salt. So, if you guys have noticed, uh, probably I would have to trim my hair um, a little bit. Right, you notice how the long hair. my hair is in the front? Yeah, I, yeah, I'm run, running the same thing right now, actually. Really? Maybe a little bit longer, but yeah. At least this doesn't go by my mouth. Actually, it is close to my mouth. Holy shit. Oh, God. <laughs> I should trim it. Might want to probably trim that then if it's like that close. Yeah. Anyways, guys, back on topic. Um, pretty much there's going to be more updates and whenever I can up upload videos and record videos. Holy shit, I almost dropped the phone. <laughs> that won't be good. You almost punched the phone? I almost dropped the phone. Oh, punched punch the phone. So anyways, um, probably tomorrow I will record StarCraft 2 Wings of the Liberty. <clears throat> because tomorrow is also my aunt and uncle's mar marriage anniversary. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. They married on uh, Valentine's Day. That's... I bet that was intentional, wasn't it? Probably. But... <laughs> they still have a long life ahead of them as well. Of course. Like, come on. We're not getting any younger. All of us are not. Amen to that, brother. Especially me, because I already have my gray hairs as it is. 
Yeah, I know. You told me about that. Even though you guys can't see my gray hairs, but they are there. I'm guessing they're hard to see. Yes, because also I have blonde highlights. Ah, oh, really? Yes, uh, which actually covers my gray hair situation. Gotcha. I need to clean this keyboard. <clears throat> yeah, can I just say cleaning keyboards is really annoying. What were you just doing? I was getting hair off of my keyboard. Oh. My dead hair, pretty much. Yeah. That's gross. I don't need to hear that. Hey, everyone sheds. Yeah, everyone sheds. And pretty much, yeah. <clears throat> By the way, um, one of the oh. one of the uh, top ten uh, henchmen in video games showed Doctor Green from Half Life Two. Oh, hello, I'm sixty. Oh yeah, this is good fun. Ray, did you hear me? I cannot hear you at the moment. Hold on. All of you zombies. Okay, what did you say? On uh, the top ten henchmen in video games, it's one of the spots uh, in it showed Dr. Wallace Brain from Half-Life 2. <laughs> And they want to know how Maybe. did he manage to. Also, it tells about uh, stuff about how he becomes the ruler of Earth just by his yeah. having Earth surrender. Yeah, surrender. Yeah. Yeah. But in the end, they're gonna be uh, if it doesn't even matter. Yeah, if uh, Valve decides to uh, really to make uh, Half Life Three, come on, Valve. Please, Valve. As, as the great child above would say, just do it. If you guys have a new writer of the Half Life series right now, then yeah, that'd be great. Oh, trust me, everybody would know because people freaking freak out if there's anything related to Half Life. Yes. Since like, Half Life, like, uh, no sneezes. Half Life is one of the oldest series from Valve, so I pretty much respect that. Yes. Plus, uh, just respect. Half Life is seventeen years old of its anniversary, the first Half Life that was made. I have been trying to play the original Half Life more. Yeah. I she would, like, sweat and cough and that sort of stuff. Yes. Which, by the way, me and Zach did, like, five uh, sense swap maps. Yes. It, it in, was... In, in span of, like, a whole night. And plus, um, I my brain just decided to go... After that. Yeah, your brain crapped after that. You, like, passed out. Yeah. Oh, God, face tank, no. No, 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 don't do this to me. I can pretty much hear the shower right no, no, now. No, 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 no. If you guys can hear oh, that geez. right through that wall, you can pretty much hear a lot. A freaking zombie! What's going on with the zombie, right? Oh, that was fun. Okay, everybody, here's a funny noise for you. <laughs> You'll be seeing that in a video eventually, trust me. Trust me, it's pretty funny. Especially you get to hear that in Nekopara. Uh, really? Wait, wait, really? Yes. On Nekopara wow. Volume Zero. Why would you want to hear that? I mean, 
Because they burned their tongue by uh, drinking coffee. Because it was hot. So that makes them go redder, 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 redder? And, uh... So one of the cat girls got, uh, which was coconut, she got ice. Don't you like coconut? Nah, I'm pretty much, uh, in, I, I'm pretty much, uh, my favorite, all my two favorites would be chocolate, chocolate. or vanilla. I mean, yeah, that sounds like, yeah, that sounds about right. Yeah. But if you guys want more anime game series, I will record uh, Hyper Dimension Neptunia. Wait, you still haven't done that. No, I haven't. <laughs> I haven't done that yet. I did not know that. And even my friend Troy, but one of, one of the first friends recommended this game to me to record, and it's a horror game, which will probably give me bad problems. And it's pretty hard as balls. That would be SCP. Containment Breach. And it'll make me shit my pants majorly. And I may fall over or pass out. Either of the two. One of those. But there will be a lot of stuff to showcase. Even, um, if you guys want more of those unboxing videos on my Shadow Death Play channel, let me know. Ugh, I decided I'd do one. <clears throat> because. Yeah. <laughs> because I've been waiting to get a new controller since last year. Which I got now. Whoa. There we go. Come boom. But anyways, um, all right, back to um topics. Um, there'll be more uh gameplay. Um, I will start my Star Search to start my Star Search Troopers Let's Play. By continuing it, but not yet, even though it's a, a forgotten series. Yep. Even uh, AVB2, which I will start that, because I have it reinstalled. So I'm going to be oh, continuing yeah. Yeah. the Marine campaign, and then on Primal Hunt, I will start Pred Alien, Predator, and Corporate. Corporates are pretty much infantry soldiers, are which work for Wailing Utani. Wailing Utani. So yeah, if you guys want me to play on uh, hard mode or nightmare difficulties on AVP three, then yeah, I'll start a let's play series of those, of uh, of those difficulties. Those games, I'm confident. I'm those games I'm confident you could do on those difficulties because you're pretty decent at those. Yeah, even though how rusty I am on AVP three. <laughs> yeah. But if you want co-op videos, it's going to be on this channel. Yes. Yeah. Oh, and speaking of like multiplayer things. Yes. We're trying to catch up on stuff. Uh, most recently, we did Half Life One and Black Mesa. Oh yeah, and Maybe we'll be thinking about doing a Half Life Opposing Force randomness series. Oh yeah, the multiplayer in that. Yeah, and then it'll also get have you to have the barnacle, the knife, and spore launcher, which is pretty fun. <laughs> But whenever we're done with the Half-Life uh, co-op series on Fan Co-op 5.0, then we're going to move on to Opposing Force and then Blue Shift. And then the maps. Yeah, and by the time we get to that, considering how slow we've been with Fan Co-op content, yes. uh, <laughs> there will probably be a map pack out because they're talking about they're working on that. Oh, yes. 
Yes. And also, Afraid of Monsters. Oh. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But Afraid of Monsters hasn't come out yet. Well, there's the original one. But it won't work on this computer. There's, there's the original, and then there's a uh, director's cut, and then there's that one that um, un uh, Andreas announced a while back. Yes. Which they are working I'm on a new one. Mean, like a couple years ago. They are still working on a new one of Afraid of Monsters, and it's going to have co-op in it. Well, that's what we've been told that they're working on it, because we've never seen it in any other media besides the first time they uh, announced it. Some yeah. people think they've stopped doing it, or they're taking hiatus or something, but I don't know. Yeah. But... <sighs> that ever does come out, though, you'll more likely be seeing that from us, so. Yes. And you'll also see me do my uh, Cry Fear Let's Play, but I would have to kill the first boss again! Ugh. Oh, yeah, and we need to do the Cry Fear Suicide maps. Yes, yes. Uh, I didn't forget. At least. Uh, Jockey, don't do that to me. Jockey wants you. <laughs> <laughs> it wants to right 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 Here we go. Anywho, back on uh, multiplayer topic. Um, yeah. On Fan Co-op 5.0, we'll also do They Hunger. Max. Oh yeah, yeah. We're gonna do what they have for They Hunger. They don't have the full thing. It just has like up to. I don't even remember to be honest with you. Yes. It's a good chunk of them, though. On They Hunger, it is pretty different, but it will bring some uh, similarities with Resident Evil, kind of. Yeah. The plan, the planned order we have to do it is uh, Half Life, then Opposing Force, then Blue Shift, then They Hunger, and then the custom maps. Yes. One of the custom maps was silly that we played. Oh my God! It was Are called. Are you talking about Richard Boderman? Um, that and Psycho. Oh yeah, Psycho. That that one took a while. My eyes were trying to adjust right, like, to uh, when we were playing through the lava. God damn. Yeah, I'm just glad there wasn't anything flashing because that that wouldn't be cool. Yes, seizures advised. Yeah, there are. If we do do that map, we'll probably have to put a little heads up on that because th there's a lot of bright colors. Yes. So. And the boss in that was fun to kill, to fight. Yeah. And it was a tour. Yeah, let's. I was about to say, let's not spoil it, but alright. Actually, it may be a tour, or maybe not be a tour. Who knows? Um, multiplayer-wise, more multiplayer videos. Um, you will see even more StarCraft Two multiplayer videos. Um, whenever I can get a chance to record StarCraft Two multiplayer with um my friend, my two friends, Jack of War and Troy. Yeah. But you may have Dizzy in the in the commentary. Knows, but I do know this: if we bring back the old gang back together again, oh my god! Basically, we're kind of just kind of waiting uh, patiently for uh, the Overjord Dark Shadow. Yes. And by the way, Dark Shadow, if you want to watch this video, the booyah! Here you go. This video is going to be having yeah. two parts to it. Right. Yeah, we're waiting for you, buddy. Yes. So, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. How are you guys' this day today? Mine's good. Uh, stupid fat man. <laughs> Boomers. I got vomited on ya. And by the way, guys, I have me and my friend Jack of War has finished Alien Swarm together. So then, eventually, we'll look for custom campaigns for that. 
<clears throat> oh yeah. Even though some games uh, Dissy doesn't like, um, I would play them anyways for fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like Insurgency, a modern infantry combat. That's a mod of Half-Life 2 and CSS. If you guys haven't played the game, or the mod, then it's free on Steam. But it requires Half-Life 2 and CSS. Come on, Tank. But I've been thinking about installing the hid hidden source again. Uh, Even though I don't like the jumping when I'm playing as the hidden, it is really hard to control for me. I wish there was a button yeah. that can have me stick to a wall instantly or whatsoever without me worrying or complaining about it. I don't really mind it too much, personally. Yeah. But if you guys are already used to, this, the, to the jumping system in uh, the hand, and that, that, that's okay. But what I like is Gary's I'm mod's a uh, game mode called The Stalker. That is similar to Hidden. Yeah, it's a, it's a little bit more unique, but its idea is similar. But I did some mind fucks on Dark Shadow before. It was fun. <laughs> <laughs> that, it was pretty funny when I just did a scream on him. Like, ah! <laughs> It does the stalker scream of Half-Life 2. It is so unique. It's so freaking annoying. Yeah, and when, uh, I haven't told, we haven't told you this, you guys this, though, because me and Ray were playing against each other one time, and he killed me. So fucking bad. I, I, I tend to do that. I was like, how do you do that? <laughs> how do you do that? Oh, man. But we will play um, I, other game modes like Zombie Survival, probably in a server. Probably. Because um, Zombie yeah. Survival is one of the oldest mod ad uh, game modes that we played back then. And it was pretty Honestly, fun. Honestly, I think Zombie Survival in general is just one of the oldest like game modes in general for Gary's mod. Yeah, th that's what I was m saying, man. Yeah. But, uh, there are a lot of new game modes for Garrus Mon now. Um, but he, but if we, me and him uh, starts playing Stop It Slender, I think he'll be Slender Man. Or I will be. Who yeah. knows? <laughs> I'm, I'm a better Slender in that. I'm not really too good for hunting the pages. Yeah. I like being I'm Slender. I'm talking, talking about the actual page, but not like pieces of paper, no. Collecting pages in the actual game of Slender is really bad because you'll have Slender Man after you. Find some gas. You want some gas, man? Alright. Yeah, I need I need some good old gas for the Just take off my cap and pour it in. <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't even know what that means. It's a from a freaking uh, 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 it's from a prop hunt video with Vanos, Wildcat, Mini Lad, Ohm. Ew. Oh my god, it's funny. <laughs> uh, anyways. <clears throat> More multiplayer what videos was wise. Um, you'll be seeing a lot of the good uh, videos then. You probably enjoyed the video from Firefight Reloaded that I did back. Uh, Back in January. Now that you said that, I kind of want to play some Firefight Reloaded. <laughs> I wouldn't mind, but I'm playing like Golden Eye Rogue Agent right now. <laughs> I just got a 007 feel. 
Uh, I haven't played that game in probably over a year now. I haven't beaten the game. I've beaten it before. It's not worth it, trust me. But still, it's part of the 007 series. Yeah, the ending sucks balls. Just gonna be honest with you. I'm pretty much at the last level in the game. Last level is the freaking stupidest thing. I have to deal with weapons that kills me with one shot with armor, with full armor or no armor. The fucking the omen. omen is bullshit. Yeah. And that is why, ladies and gentlemen, that the Golden Eye Shield power up is the best thing for that level. But I do pretty well with the hack, uh, hack uh, power. Because I like fucking with the enemy's weapons. <laughs> yeah. Make them quite useless. That's when I go like, that's right, buddy. Your weapon's useless. Anyways, um, videos, um, there will be more, you know, codename Cure. I haven't, uh, gotten through, uh, I think we're gonna cut this short right now, um. Yeah. Because my phone just reached uh, maximum memory, so there will be the next update. Peace out. Keep on the stealth. Latest. Bye. Everyone, and this is Light Dark Blade ninety three. Um, there has been going a lot of things. Um, um, well, I won't speak of it, but. If, um, you will probably know, um, back when I was starting as a YouTuber in 2010, uh, for my, sh as ShadDeathBlade93, um, which is my single player Let's Play channel, that's when I got inspired to make my content, but also when, uh, 2011 came around, that's when I still had my cat, Sylvesto, around. And she was pretty adorable. She kind of acted like I was one of her... Uh, she acted like a mother to me. But it was kind of strange, even though she was a cat. But what she was, she was a bl black and white tabby. Which is very interesting. She kind of reminds me of Sylvester from Looney Tunes... But the color scheme was kind of different. But I wish I could have uh, uploaded the videos from my f old uh, one of my older phones uh, that was back um, when I still had um, Sylvester around, and then that's when she died as well. She uh, died in February twenty fifth, two thousand eleven. It was a very sad time for me. And she has been gone for a very long time. So I forgot to do an anniversary for her last month. Because she died in February 25th, 2011. Um, it was very sad. She was a very lovable cat. The most funniest thing she ever did when she was, uh, also when she was a kitten were, um, to play around with, uh, with everyone in the house's feet whenever they're trying to sleep, especially my mom's, even though she learned not to play with my mom's feet because, uh, she got kicked right against to, um, mom's closet and she went like, Phew. And then she started shaking her head like this. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> it was cute. But also funny at the same time, even though... But... Those were times when she was a kitten, and when she was still uh, growing up... It was really, really good. Even though she got into my little sister Elizabeth's pumpkin pie. Even licking off the Cheeto, the cheese from the Cheetos off of our fingers. It was adorable. Cute. 
kawaii, you know. I pretty much love cats. Also love dogs too, but when I, uh, I still have some scars on me. I have a scar on my right shoulder, right here. It's a long scratch, and it is pretty much raining outside. And I can hear it, and my monitor went off. Shit. <laughs> but those were times when I was young, and hello, George. In these times, I have been wondering, how am I going to keep my depression away from my other from my times that I play games and such. And I have to I had to distract myself by not feeling depressed or anything. But by thinking of Sylvester, it is a very fun I have so many fond memories of my cat Sylvester. Every time when I'm sick, she always lays right here, right by my feet. Right next to my feet of whenever I'm sick. And she always made sure that I'm doing okay. And then when mom comes in and give me medicine to help me to get better, Sylvester just glares at her like, Bitch, you better not have given him something bad. <laughs> it was adorable. But rest in peace, Sylvester. Always. You'll always be in my heart. And also... You're in a better place, too. Even though I still have a feeling that she's around in spirit. There are things that are unbelievable whenever you can't see it. Or when you do see it and you can't even believe it, either. And it's from the traits that you pick up. When you are born genetically, genetic traits start to to pick up inside of your body, and then boom, you got those genetic traits. Whenever your adrenaline starts going in into your bloodstream, it always uh, gives you unbelievable speed, strength, etc. But normally, I don't need to use my adrenaline to do all that stuff. But... It was very, very sad whenever I heard about Sylvester's death for me. <sighs> it... <sighs> my cousin's girlfriend saw... Sylvester lying there with her claw stuck on my mom's bed. And it was very sad for me. When I heard from it, when I got back home. And I was looking for Sylvester, and I couldn't see her anywhere. Until my cousin Chris, my mom, everyone in the house told me that Sylvester has passed. Oh, and hi, Ray. Um, I'm planning, uh, I'm doing a anniversary video of, uh, Sylvester. You wanna join in? I suppose, sure, yeah. And you are up. Oh, I can tell, yeah. So, pretty much, it has been, let's see, 2011, 2012, 2013, 2014, 2015, and 2016. Those are six yep. years by Sylvester's death. Because she died in February 25th, 2011. So, yeah. So, she is buried out in the front yard. But, if you can know if someone is still there with you, even though they are gone, they are still with you in spirit. Yeah. It's how you can tell. But pretty much everything changes in life. 
Yep. Pretty much. And then you start to see things that are completely different. Like, seriously. Yep. But this video is dedicated to my cat, Sylvesta. Even though I can't get the other videos from my old phones. From my old phone that I used to have. But it's white, but it's from a- from- I'm not gonna say it. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> Ray knows what I'm <laughs> talking about. Oh yeah, I remember, yeah. I so, remember, you know, when that happened. Yeah. And my monitor went off again, and me. it's dark. Yeah. And pretty much everyone was trying to console me, and it it couldn't be uh, it couldn't be done. Yeah. Until my dad told me to distract myself by doing something, and that's what I did. Yeah, that's 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 like a uh, that's that's kind of a good way to you know distract yourself and that sort of thing, you know. Yes, and then do something else, you know, do something that you enjoy. Yes, and then pretty soon at May 4th, I will do a video dedicated to my dad, even though, yeah, I may feel depressed, maybe, I don't know, but he was still a good dad, no matter what, but there were some things that happened that were bad too, so I don't want to explain. Yeah. No but need to. It's all right. I will talk about the good oh. times. That's it. Mm -hmm. The bad times? No. Just no. Yeah. But as I was saying, when I was coming home from school, I was in high school still. When yeah. Sylvester passed away. Crazy. And I was pretty much still a sophomore then. Yeah, yeah. Like I am right now. Yeah. <clears throat> Wait a minute, aren't you aren't you 16 right now? Yes, yes I am. Yeah. And you'll be 17 soon next December yeah, 1st. I, yeah, this December, yeah. I, it's like what the cow. Yes. And I can't believe how many years have passed since Sylvester has died, passed away, you know. To all my friends, all yeah. to all the fans out there that supports my channels, I haven't, uh, I haven't been here without you guys either. Mm-hmm, yeah. You guys made the thing... The impossible. Of course. You know, he's still here because you guys have been supporting the best you can. That's why you're still here making videos while I tag along being a nerd on this uh, multiplayer channel. <laughs> yes. And also, to a, a little shout-out to my friend that I'm talking with. Dissy Bertani Knight, which is also Dissy, mm. to his little yeah. sister that watches some of our some of the videos that I made with him. Uh, <laughs> yeah, she's pretty sweet. Yes. Uh, Excuse me. Her name is Bethany. Yeah. This is a special shout out to you, Bethany, which is my best friend, Dissy. It's a little sister. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for watching the content that I've been making with uh, your brother, Ray. Yeah, and it's been fun. There. And there are, will be times when we will continue our CSS uh, gameplay. Oh, yeah. But don't worry, in the very future, we will bring back Counter-Strike Global Offensive. But I uninstalled yeah. that game for now. 
He's got that, he uninstalled it for space, right? Yes. For, uh, to have more space for recordings and such, but it is quite difficult. But anyways, I think that would be, it'd probably be it for, uh, Sylvester's, uh, anniversary uh, video that I have not made it's from six years now. <laughs> yeah. It is unbelievable. Yeah, it is. It's crazy. Yeah. And pretty soon, guys, there will be more videos in the future. And especially, yep. Sven Corp is going to be coming. Oh, yeah. Sven Corp 5.0. Woo! It's seriously awesome. Yes. We will bring up that series. And we may bring some friends to join us. To join us on our yeah. Hamachi. Yeah, if we get, if we, we might be able to get, um, uh. Eat our found dark snipe, you know, George, and uh, yes. as well, maybe my friend Rose, but we'll see. Or I can also bring along Jack of War because he, he also to, plays yeah. the game. But we'll see you guys next time, and it's freaking raining outside. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> but I also had a long day, so yeah, it is March 4th, yeah. 2016, everyone. And I will do recap Let's Plays as well, so, for my Shadow Death Play channel. What the fuck? Yeah. What's that? What, did you hear something? Yeah, I heard uh, probably my sister scream or my mom scream. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Not, or it <laughs> indicates that they're laughing or something. I don't know. But we'll see you guys next time in the next videos. Peace out. Keep on the stealth. Laters. Later. This is Light Dark Blade 93, also aka Shadow Death Blade 93. With me is my friend Colton. Hello. If you may remember, he was in my videos of Binding of Isaac, and you were able to hear him during that our mine and Ditsy's playthrough of Death Toll on Left 4 Dead 1. So here is Colton, and yeah. But pretty much this is an update video of 2016, which is the fourth update video of this year. Um, today is March... March 5th. Yes. <clears throat> and I'm at his house, but pretty soon I will upload this when uh, when I get home. So, I'm just hanging out with him today. Really? <laughs> the bunny ears? Yes. What can you do? Even though I can't do a video of Cutie Rat, I'm able to do a video like this. Are you doing the bunny no, ears? No, no. I wasn't. Okay. <laughs> but anyways, we done a lot of stuff uh, when I was hanging out with him, like, few past years. Yep. Like, um, when I first met him in 2012. Not 2012. 2013. Yeah. yeah. 2013 is when I met him. And uh, throughout 14, 15, and now 16. Um, yeah. Yeah. I've pretty much been hanging out with Colton a lot. Basically. And it's pretty much fun. And yes. pretty much, um, yeah. I've been doing a lot of stuff. And I'm going to be, when I get home, I'll be recording Cry Fear Suicide. Co-op with Dissy, Bertani Knight, which is my friend Ray, on Steam. So, pretty much. If you guys want more videos, like uh, for my Shadow Death Play channel, I'll be doing that in the future eventually. I don't know when, but it depends on how tired I am or, you know. So, yeah, and pretty much Colton has been watching my videos a lot, and yeah. Yep, that's true. Yeah, pretty much the, there has been a lot of problems from uh, the community guidelines and all that because of our best YouTubers' uh, channels that have been got deleted recently, such as Lost Pause's main channel, but he has a, a, ba a backup channel at least, but I hope this stuff, the ghost, has, will go through eventually, but 
hopefully that stops. But yeah, I've been uploading my own videos with my own content. And yeah, I've been thanking you guys by supporting my channels, especially to all my friends. And I, I, I bet uh, James hardly sees my videos, but barely, barely, yeah. barely. Yeah, but I wonder how he's going to react when you're in the video. <laughs> I don't know, and I don't care. <laughs> yeah, so it is pretty much um, like eight. Oh, it's eight oh four. Yeah, four minutes after eight. And pretty much it'll be time for me to go eventually, but... So yeah, how's your guys' day today? Mine's good, but I've been suffering from a lot of pain lately. And my nose is itchy. Why? And by the way, it's raining. Pouring rain. When it rains, it pours. You know the song to it. But that's a reference from StarCraft 1, so... So, anyways, guys, um, you guys remember about my two videos, the three videos that I uploaded recently, and, yeah. So, yeah, more Cry Fear co-op. Coming right up when I get home. Woot. <laughs> anyways, um, Colton, you want to talk about any of my videos? <laughs> well, I really pretty much enjoyed his, um, shouted... The Slender the Nine Pages video. I really enjoyed it. It made me laugh. A lot. <laughs> yeah. Especially by me going like... <gasps> and I was laughing because of what George kept saying. Yes. And it was getting really old pretty fast. That's what was funny. I, a lot. Yeah. Big time. Pretty much, yeah. And if you guys want more videos in the future, like for my Light Dark Blade channel, we will be doing more um, Counter-Strike Source with, with the return of the CSS series and pretty much the return of CSGO. <clears throat> and pretty much we are going to be doing more custom campaigns for Left 4 Dead 2 versus Survival <clears throat> Scavenge. For Left 4 Dead 2, and so on. And Left 4 Dead 1 has versus survival and campaign mode, which uh, we already done all the official campaigns. We finished that like a couple of days ago, like a couple of weeks ago, actually, because we finished uh, Blood Harvest and The Sacrifice. And I was playing as Bill, the old man, and uh, I had to sacrifice myself <laughs> in memory of Zach, <laughs> sadly. But yeah, there is pretty much a lot of videos I have to do, like finish certain Let's Plays and all that. Uh, I don't know when I'm going to get around by continuing my Cry of Fear Let's Play. I don't know when, but it's it's been pin in the butt. <clears throat> because it is terrifying when you're playing in the dark. Especially... Yes. Markiplier did that before. Yes, he's was, done that many times. Yeah. Even though it has a good atmosphere, I'd rather play in the when it's light out. Obviously, yes. Because Cry of Fear is terrifying. So I saw. Yeah, in my Cry of Fear videos, I was playing that around like, like 1 a.m. in the morning. Damn. Staying up throughout the night, and it was pretty scary. <clears throat> But I had Dissy uh, comforting me a bit. Yeah. And then, after that, I decided to sleep. Yep. Yay. So, a couple days uh, when uh, without any recording, and then I had some sleep. Good. Because, uh, like, two times, two last times when I was here, I passed out of my bed. Yeah, I went, everybody do the flop. Yeah. But anyways. We are going to be watching um, Rooster Teeth's uh, videos. Oh, Ruby. Yeah. And, yeah, because I introduced it to him, and, yeah, it's pretty awesome. It's pretty interesting, yeah. Yep. And, yeah. To everyone out there, 
keep supporting my channels, and uh, I'll keep on making more content okay. as well. Okie doke. What? <laughs> I wasn't agreeing with what you said. <clears throat> Ow. <laughs> now my back is itchy. Wow. Hey, you can't blame me. Yeah, I get that too. You might hear that in the video. That was a major crack. Ooh, okay. Anyways, everyone, um... I think we should uh, get to the watching Ruby, and I'll see you guys next time. Yep. If you guys, um... This is actually a short update, but yeah, I mean, we're doing pretty good, and yeah. Can not agree more? Yeah, pretty much, uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, I, I don't know what else to say, pretty much, but yeah. I'll see you guys next time in the next videos. Peace out. Keep on the stuff. Bye. Peace. Bye.